92.7 WOBM, Sean and Sue with you on a brand new Thursday morning with Kelly Clarkson, 842, 69 degrees. And Sue, we are joined by two of our friends here this morning, Hack and Sack Meridian Health co-CEOs Bob Garrett and John Lloyd are here with us this morning to talk about some new things from U.S. News and World Report. Oh, Bob and John, good morning and welcome back, morning, gentlemen. Guys. Good morning, good morning, Sean and Sue. Sean and Sue, How's great to be back. How's everything going at the hospital? Everything good? Amazing. Yeah? Yep, everything is is great. Perfect. We have Excellent. Some great news to share with your listeners. Excellent. Well, Bob, can you start things off? Give us some details about your top rankings in U.S. News and World Report. Sure, uh, Sean. Uh, we're really pleased to uh, to announce that four of our hospitals at Hackensack Meridian Health are amongst the top 10 hospitals in the state of New Jersey as ranked by U.S. News and World Report. So Hackensack University Medical Center is number one in the state for six straight years since uh, U.S. News started uh, doing these uh, rankings. So, you know, kudos to the team up at, uh, at Hackensack. Mm-hmm. Awesome. But it, even better news uh, this year, three other hospitals are in that top 10. So Jersey Shore University Medical Center in Neptune came in at number four. Great team over there, too. They're providing excellent, excellent um, patient care. And then Ocean Medical Center and Riverview uh, Medical Center uh, were tied at number eight. And what this means is really, it's it's it, the award is great, but it's really about the hard work, the patient outcomes, the quality of care that's delivered each and every day by those uh, by those teams. So, could not be more proud of the the doctors, the nurses, the entire team uh, throughout the network. And by having four hospitals in that top ten, uh, there's no other health system in New Jersey that uh, comes even mm. close. So. We're, uh, we're, we're really proud of awesome. the, the, the work yeah. that's going on. Oh, what done. a team effort. Yeah. So, John, let me ask you, you know, when we talk about what does this tell folks about your hospitals that they might not already know? Do consumers take these rankings like U.S. News and World Report to heart? Yes, there's no question that uh, the consumers uh, look at these rankings. We have uh, social media, and we're in constant contact with all of our constituents and listeners and everyone else. So absolutely it matters uh, whether you, whether someone is looking for a new physician or whether they are, already have a physician. They're very interested in how the organization ranks and how the physicians rank. Yeah. Now, Bob, let me ask you, I actually ask both of you, what does it take to get these top rankings? Is it all about recruitment of physicians, nursing staff, best equipment like MRIs, robotic surgery, all of the above? What do the two of you feel, you know, adds to this? Sean, it really is all of the, uh, all of the above. Um, you know, it, you really have to have the, uh, the, the, the top doctors in place, the, uh, the nursing uh, team. And I have to say with the, the nursing team, uh, we've, you know, we've been a, uh, magnet um, health system, magnet hospitals, which mm. is really recognizes nursing excellence. Uh, we've been, you know, at Hackensack uh, was the first in the nation to become a, a magnet certified um, hospital behind the pilot program out on the West Coast. Oh. So the physician, you know, recruiting the, the top physicians is very important, not only for the patient care that they render, but their, their teaching, their, uh, their research. The technology is really important to U.S. News and World Report. You know, U.S. News really recognizes that the top hospitals around the country are hospitals that really have perfected uh, various procedures within their area. And, uh, you know, it, it's about the number of cases that are done, but it's also about using really state-of-the-art uh, technology. So really proud of the – it's it's, a, it's truly a team effort. It's, it's mm-hmm. the doctors, the nurses, the technology, the facilities, you know, the entire healthcare team – that really can produce the kind of results that U.S. News & World Report recognizes. And, and just to add to that, Sean, uh, we, Hackensack Meridian Health is recognized nationally for certain specialties, and those specialties are oncology, neurology, uh, mm-hmm. neurosurgery, orthopedics, urology, and open-heart surgery. So again, uh, these, this is another ranking, and we do very, very well in these rankings. And, and we have one, you know, in particular in our children's hospital that has uh, received national rankings as well, and that's um, for pediatric neurosciences, mm. for neurology and neurosurgery, which is really, really important. And it's great to have that kind of expertise mm. locally. And, and in terms of magnet status, which Bob talked about, yeah. <clears throat> only about uh, 7 or 8% um, of organizations in a whole country achieve magnet status. And we now have, I think, seven of our hospitals that have achieved that status. Mm-hmm. You know, Sue and I were talking off the air before, you know, knowing you were coming in today, and we were mentioning how health care is such a, a big item. You cannot go through a newscast, you cannot go through mm-hmm. a day uh, reading the newspaper, reading blogs, whatever it is, without health care coming up. It is Absolutely. every single day the issue of health. 
Yeah, there's no doubt about it. And, uh, you know, of course, uh, there's a lot of attention now on in Washington as to whether the Affordable Care Act is going to be uh, amended or repealed or replaced. Mm-hmm. So that's something that we, we follow closely. And, you know, we, we, we just want to make sure that um, there's good health care coverage, good health care insurance for all residents of New Jersey. Excellent. And, Sean, one other thing I want to mention is a big shout-out to six of our long-term care and rehab centers who were also recognized by U.S. News and World Report and also by Medicare for having five-star rating, which is the highest rating you can get. And uh, uh, six of our facilities achieved that. And again, only 13% of all facilities in the country achieved that. Mm. So it's been a, a uh, a a great month for us with all these recognitions. And as Bob said, it's not so much the award. It, it really is a tribute to the team members and to our nurses and physicians who do a great job day in and day but out. But it feels good. It's just like we did when, you know, when you're, whether you're in fifth grade and you come home with straight <laughs> right. A's on your report card or you're, you know, here we are as adults and you get your business report card and yeah. it comes through strong like five, this. Five stars, certainly better than one, right? There you go. <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely. Uh, gentlemen, thank you for being with us. Hackensack Marine Health co-CEOs, Bob Garrett and John Lloyd, always good to have you in and let us know what's going on with our health care guys. Thank you very much. Thanks for having us. Sean, thank you. It's always a pleasure.